Live streamers are unique in the fact that their online persona is their brand. And having the correct tools to show to potential sponsors or community members can be very difficult when it's spread across several different online platforms. Thus, why Streamlabs has creator sites so you can consolidate your brand, your monetization, and your business into one spot. And in this video right here, I'm gonna show you everything you need to get up and running with creator websites so that way you have a professional tool to market yourself. Let's go. Hey all, wild for games here to help you become bigger and better with your online content creation with Streamlabs. Now really quick, if you wanna use creator sites, it is an exclusive tool for Streamlabs Prime members only. If you wanna become one, I'll make sure to put a link down in the video description below so that way you can click through and join today. Now, if you're not sure if you wanna make the investment right away into Streamlabs Prime, hey, it's okay. We give everybody the option to completely customize a draft website so you exactly know what you're gonna get for a final product so you can still do everything I'm gonna teach you here to see if you like it before you purchase. To edit your website, log into streamlabs.com and click on website. This will take you to the main creator editor page. We're gonna go through them all, so let's start off with themes. We have top designers like Nerd or Die, Visuals by Impulse, Owned, and more creating new themes for creator sites every day. At the moment, there's currently over 400 different themes that you can choose from. Simply click on any one of the themes and you're off to creating your own website. Now, if you have a certain style or flair that you wanna refine it down to, all you need to do is click on the site themes color, which will refine down to the certain aesthetics of what you're looking for on your creator site. If you're not sure of your branded colors just yet, you can also refine your search by category. There's games, minimalistic, clean, bold, vibrant, fun, futuristic. This gives you a little way to refine down what kind of style your stream is again, if you prefer to search this way. Next, we have domain, which is where you get to select a custom web address. With creator sites, you can pick your very own custom domain. Having a custom domain adds that professional credibility to your brand. If you already have your own custom domain, you can link it here as well. When it comes to designing your website, no coding skills required. Under design, there's a few different tabs here, so let's tackle them one by one so you have a greater understanding of how to customize them. Site design allows you to upload an additional background image and toggle on immersive mode, which will make the content blocks fill out the whole width of your website. Content design is the section vertical padding option that allows you to adjust the vertical padding between content blocks on your website and change the color of the content blocks. Adding a component border allows you to define the content blocks by giving them a border. The component quarter radius allows you to smooth out the edges of your content blocks, giving them more of a rounded appearance. Typography allows you to choose the font used on your website. You can pick heading color and body text color. Buttons allow you to add variety, which lets you choose how you'd like the buttons on your page, like the donation button to appear. You can choose to have your buttons rounded, sharp, hollow, or filled with color. The background color in the navigation section will customize the color at the top of your website where the social media links and links to other important pages like your tip page are included. Logo position will change the location of your channel image. The default position is located on the left, or you can choose to move them to the center. Scroll position will let you choose if you'd like your channel image to remain fixed on top of the page and always remain present when people scroll. You can also change the size of your logo and shape. The content page is where you get to pick and choose what you want to be displayed on your website. And this is where you get to customize and play around with it. You can make one impactful page if that's what you prefer for a more minimalistic approach, or perhaps you wanna have more detailed separate pages for things like your own merch store or social media. It's really up to you and how you wanna design your website. Depending on the theme you choose, certain content modules will already be appearing on your website. If you'd like to add another content block to your website, simply click on the plus sign, choose the design of the module and drag and drop the content block you want onto the page. 
Just to let you know, if you already have Streamlabs Merch Store or CloudBot or MediaShare enabled, those pages will automatically appear in the auto-generated page management section. There are a ton of components. I'm gonna put a graphic here up on screen to give you a quick overview of what you can drag and drop into creator websites. But I really recommend you play around with which ones you think would be best to give a good representation of your stream and your brand. Next, we have a custom email. And having a custom email allows you to set up a dedicated mailbox on your custom domain. This mailbox allows you to send and receive emails like a professional. Incoming emails to your new mailbox are forwarded to your current email. To send emails using your new mailbox, you have to add it to an email client such as Gmail. In the SEO settings category, you can customize the header and description that appears on Google when people search for you. This is great for targeting keywords you want your page to appear on when people search for them. Under analytics, you can customize the header and description that also appears on Google when people search for you. Another great way for targeting keywords for when people search for you. In the settings category, you can adjust the stream chat sidebar visibility to always remain visible in your embedded live stream or only when you are live. You can also add additional social media handles and choose which platform you'd like your live stream feed to come from. If you plan on taking your live stream to the next level and you wanna have more of a personal brand and more professionalism, hey, you might wanna look into creating your own website as a live streamer. And using Streamlabs' tools is one of the best ways to do it because we make it so easy for you. Now, if you're not sure if it's right to jump in right away and create your own website with Streamlabs Prime because you're just starting out or you're still working towards affiliate, hey, we got you covered. I'm gonna put two videos here up on screen that shows you how to reach Twitch affiliate really fast and also how to start streaming on Facebook Gaming because we also support that platform too. Until next time, I can't wait to see you guys. Take care, as always, Wild for Games, helping you become bigger and better, and of course, peace.